welcome back to Good Day Stateline. Today, we're getting the chance to talk with Kevin and Dee. So Kevin is the president and owner of Carpetland USA, and Dee is the executive director of Rock House Kids. So the real question, of course, is why am I talking to both of you at once? <laughs> well, yes, let us know, I'll Kevin. start Dee real quick. Uh, my, my wife and I, I'll give you a little story here, where we saw the uh, mural that the Rock House kids did recently. And we just thought we would love to help any way we can. And uh, I, I grew up where uh, my dad was a minister and we didn't have a lot of money. And at Christmas time, often uh, some of the people that he pastored would drop off a check for money and I knew that's where our Christmas gifts were coming and my parents would give them, you know, a big hug and uh, it was very touching. So we both decided we want to try to help any way possible. So we thought we'd do a fundraiser or a drive, a donation drive. And I reached out to Rock House Kids and Dee was very gracious and said, here are the items we need and we'd love to assist in any way. So Dee, I'll let you take it from there. Okay, first of all, I think that's very sweet how you say we're gracious. You are the ones that are blessing the kids. So thank you so much. Um, you're right. Our kids don't get everything that they would like for Christmas. Sometimes there's nothing. It's just what we get at Rock House Kids. So when Kevin came alongside and said that they wanted to help, that was such a huge blessing. So we can have stocking stuffers for the kids and it's cold. The kids need their coats and their boots and hats and gloves. And um, so this is going to just warm up their Christmas, both physically and in their hearts. I love this so much because, you know, this has been a, a tough year for everyone, but it's such an important reminder to, to think that, yeah, it might be harder to get your favorite groceries or yeah, you know, you might be working from home when you don't want to be working from home, but that is not as big of an inconvenience or a negative on your life that might be going on in someone else's life. So this is like a perfect example of remembering to be, you know, thankful and grateful for what you do have and that we all can, you know, help out still. So Saturday, November 7th, okay. we are going to have trucks at Carpetland USA, and I will be out there helping as well. We're going to load up whatever items people would like to donate. I have a list on the Carpetland USA website. If you go there, there is a Rock House Kids tab. If you click on that tab, it shows the list of items that Dee provided us with. So there are specific items. If people could look at that list and bring those items and Dee, if you wanted to add to it now, uh, it, let me know, uh, okay. let the folks know. All right, um, the list, right now we're trying to really stock up for the Christmas. And like I said, with the hats and the gloves, we're really low on winter stocking caps and the winter gloves that are waterproof. Okay. We, we don't have many of those right now. And we also need Christmas candy, the kit, because when we put their stockings together, they have to have candy mm -hmm. and their, um, Stocking stuffers go from age six all the way up to 18. So whether you would like to hand in a gift card to a restaurant in the area, like McDonald's or Subway, any place like that, that is something that we know they're getting some kind of food as well. So they like that, especially the teens. They also, the teens like to have cologne. So that's another type thing that um, we noticed that we are we don't have for this year. And anything that you think your child or grand, grandchild, niece, nephew would like between those ages, I guarantee you the kids would be very appreciative. I love that so much. So it's happening next Saturday. Um, and what time does it start? I don't remember if you mentioned that, Kevin. Noon okay. till four. So. We're, we'll be outside at noon. We're gonna make it very convenient. You can just come, we'll get the items right out of your vehicle. Uh, if you wanna get out and hand them to us, wonderful. If not, put them in your trunk. I will personally get them out of your trunk, however you would like to do it. Uh, but that is November 7th from noon to four at Carpetland, we'll be right in the back of the building. So we're gonna make it easy for you. If you don't wanna to touch the items as far as, you know, with us, put them in your trunk, pop the trunk, we'll get them out. Perfect. Uh, my wife and I have raised seven kids here at home and these kids <laughs> are our future. So 
we want to help them. We want to help Rockford. We're a great city. Let's make it even greater and support these kids. Coming up next, we're revealing the killer from our murder mystery with Mahoney. And later, we're talking with Dancing with the Stars' Derek Hopp. We'll be right back.